A mass radio campaign in rural Burkina Faso encouraging parents to seek medical treatment for their sick children has helped save thousands of lives, according to research published in the British medical journal Global Health. The trial targeted three of the biggest killers of children under five in the country. Our Global Health correspondent Smitha Mundasad reports. In her village in rural Burkina Faso, Marietta is known as the child of the radio. That's because her dad says the radio saved her life. When she was just one, Marietta developed a high fever and became very unwell. Then Marietta's father heard a radio campaign warning parents to watch out for signs of malaria, pneumonia and diarrhea, three of the biggest killers of young children in the country. The campaign was part of a huge experiment broadcast on seven local radio stations for three years. If you're the Minister of Health of a typical African country and you have 30 to 40 dollars per head of population to spend on health, you're literally deciding who lives and who dies. And so anything that you spend your money on has to be proven. And this has not been proven until now. It's simply never been proven that mass media can change behaviours, let alone save, save lives. The number of children like Marietta, who were seen for malaria, rose by 56% in the first year. And consultations for diarrhoea and pneumonia increased too. It wasn't just one-way messages. Parents had the chance to call in to interactive shows, sharing questions and concerns. They've also worked with local people in developing scripts and dramas and stories that are really engaging and get people's emotions going and make it much more likely that people are going to behave based on listening um, as opposed to just thinking that it's um, information given to them from some expert. The project took place in an unusual media landscape. This campaign may have worked well in a rural area where almost everyone listens to their local radio station. The question is, would it do as well in parts of the world where TV stations and the internet all compete for people's attention? And media messages can only do so much. Good health care is crucial. But while children still die from avoidable illnesses, hearing the right information may help save lives. Smitha Mundasad, BBC News.